by backing up your website at regular intervals, you will have a copy of it saved somewhere other than your own server, which protects it from hacking or other website failures. If something happens to your website, you can easily restore the previous version from your backups. Manually backing up your website is an added burden to your productivity. Hence, we can set up an automatic backup system just once and it will keep taking the backups without any manual efforts. Hi guys, this is Shaswan Valia from Team Learn Today and in this SOP, we will learn how to set up an automatic backup of your WordPress website using the Updraft Plus plugin by storing your backups on your Google Drive. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Once you're on your WordPress dashboard to schedule automatic backups for your WordPress website, what you need to do is find settings in your left sidebar from right here. And as you can see, Updraft plus backups is there. So we will click on that. Great, so once you have landed on your Updraft plus backup restore page, scroll down. And as you can see, we already have one backup that we took in our one of the previous SOPs. If you haven't checked it out, go ahead, check it out, and then come back to this video uh, to schedule the automatic backups. So what you need to do is go to settings from here. And over here, you'll have files backup schedule or database backup schedule. So what you can do is you can schedule it for every two hours, every four hours, every eight hours, every 12 hours, daily, weekly, fortnightly, or monthly. So what we'll do is we'll keep it weekly for both of these and retain this many scheduled backups. So what will happen is this particular backup that we'll have weekly will be there for the next two weeks. So if we take a backup today, it's gonna stay for the next two weeks. So we'll keep this as three weeks. Great. And you can choose a remote storage where you can go ahead and store this backup. So we will keep this as Google Drive. And once you have done with these settings, once you have selected these settings according to your needs, you need to scroll down and save these changes. Once you save these changes, this particular a uh, pop-up will come. You have selected a remote storage option which has an authorization step to complete. Follow this link to access the Google Drive account. So you need to sign in with Google. Or if you have already signed in, then you'll get to choose from these particular um, accounts which one you want to go ahead with. And it wants to access your Google account. Just hit on allow. And once you do that, you just need to hit on complete setup and your changes will be saved. All right, so we have completed our setup and every week there will be a backup taken of your WordPress website, which will remain for the next three weeks. After those three weeks, that particular backup will be deleted. So every week this thing is gonna Come, it's going to be a loop. So you don't have to worry about manually going ahead and taking a backup anymore. We have successfully uh, scheduled an automatic backup for our WordPress website. Hope you guys were able to successfully schedule automatic backup system for your WordPress website. I will be coming up with a lot of WordPress related videos. So stay tuned for that. You can go ahead and Comment down below if you have any queries, any suggestions, or any other videos that you would like to see on our Learn Today channel. Go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe button, along with the notification bell icon so that you can get updates on whenever we come up with new videos. This is Shaswan Valia, and I will see you in our next SOP.